In this video, we will show you how to fix the game 7 days to die that won't open in Windows 11 using the Xbox app. The game comes with Game Pass Ultimate and you can play it on your PC using Xbox app. But some gamers reported the game just won't open after the installation. So if you're one of them, the first thing you need to do is to make sure that the game service isn't running in the background because that will prevent it from opening. To do that, pull up the task manager by pressing the control, shift and escape keys. Look for 7 days to die and click on it to highlight it. Now click in task and that should stop the game. After that, run it again and in most cases, it should fix the problem. However, if it still won't load, then what you need to do next is to verify and repair the installation files. You don't have to do that manually. Instead, the Xbox app will be the one to scan the game files for you. All you have to do is initiate the process and here's how it's done. Launch the Xbox app. Hover the cursor over 7 days to die and click the more options icon. Select manage and click files. Now click verify and repair and then wait until the whole process is finished. Don't worry, it will take just a few seconds to a minute. Once finished, launch the game and it should work properly after that. However, if the game still won't open after that, then it's probably due to corrupt installation. So what you need to do next is to uninstall the game and then reinstall it. Here's how you do that. Launch the Xbox app. Hover the cursor over 7 days to die and click the more options icon. Click on install game and select yes at the bottom left corner of the Xbox app to confirm. Once the game is successfully uninstalled, search for it and then reinstall it. It will take just a few minutes or more depending on how fast your connection is. After the game is reinstalled, it should run properly. We hope that this guide can help you. Please support us by subscribing to our channel. Thanks for watching.